We have been through a multiplicity of crises in the last few years. What we're hearing now in Davos is that we've got to find a new path. The situation has been stabilized and we're in a slow, protracted way for improvement. But there should be no complacency. Do you get blinkered? You're so focused on what you're doing that it's very easy to ignore things that are happening in the world and then they catch you by surprise. Dealing with so many challenges requires resilience. If you want to grow in this world, you've got to be planting seeds in a lot of places. You've got to be making things happen and trying new things. If companies are not doing that, they will potentially just disappear from the map. The economy is in an anemic state. Austerity may very well worsen things. The week here in Davos really puts us in contact with people in our industries and across industries that are very much forward thinking, are interested in talking about hard problems. Sustainability is now a norm within the corporate world, but it's not moving anywhere near far enough fast enough. By being really outside in and connecting to other people in the world, we can do a better job of understanding what society is concerned about and what needs can be fulfilled. What we need today is a new moment in history. China needs to have a free flow of ideas to promote creativity and innovation. Organizations need to address the institutional barriers we all know about. The more women you have in top management, the better economic results you are doing. Davos really is a battlefield for ideas. We don't take a position on issues. What we want to do is have the most relevant people coming together to exchange different ideas and perspectives. It's the bringing them together, making the connections, driving collaborations that can then truly drive impact. If you come to Davos and you're optimistic and you're a leader and you are responsible for changing your community, it's the most perfect opportunity. You meet a lot of optimistic people like you, which with little effort can create a big impact. This is the best place to Ghana and collect the information I need to make the decisions. You want to hear opinions that are very diverse in nature, which helps you form your own opinion at the end of the day. It's an incubator. It's a discussion forum. The people you meet here and the conversations you have with them are not replicable anywhere else. I believe my role is to make sure that we're not ignoring important questions, that we're asking interesting questions. We would never have educated 11,000 kids, reached 130 million people, if it had not been for a conversation that happened at the forum. Communication is the power of Davos. Only the World Economic Forum has the convening power and the neutral venue to bring together public sector, private sector, and civil society to create this 360 degree support system it has to be one of the most powerful contributions World Economic Forum has made.